Hello and welcome to Journey of a Student Nurse. My name is Lee. Welcome to my nursing vlog. I hope that you are enjoying the vlogs as much as I am making them. So let's just dive straight in and talk about what I've been up to lately. So this week from the 6th of March I to the 7th of March, I got the privilege to attend the Council of Deans Student Leadership Programme Hashtag 150 leaders if you are on Twitter, follow that hashtag or follow the Council of Deans, see what they've been up to. So what is the Student Leadership Programme and what is the Council of Deans? Well the Council of Deans is a member body which represents all the faculties of health science across the UK and in particular it's across the 83 universities that do health care programmes such as nursing, midwifery and allied health professions. So it's been really good to attend this programme and I have to say I did not know what to expect. I was kind of expecting sort of the kind of lecture kind of things throughout the two days that I was there but it wasn't really sort of lecture kind of based. In fact, it was more kind of like, kind of a bit like it, but it was more just like, I don't know, just, it was really exciting where they were just talking about leadership, where they were kind of talking about the different styles and just engage, getting us to engage. I think one thing that made the the program, or it made the induction um, to the program more exciting is that the 50 people who are attending in this cohort, the fourth cohort, of the program um, is just the one thing that made it really special is that everyone there, myself included, wanted to be there. They wanted to develop their leadership skills. They wanted to enhance that ability. And when it came to doing some group work projects, it's not like your sort of typical university kind of group project where you get thrown together with a bunch of strangers, get asked to produce a, a presentation very quickly. This, is, this was completely different. Everyone in the group that I worked with from the first day, really wanted to do that project and we, even though it was kind of a we had an hour to do something and present it we really brought we really came together really quickly because we were highly motivated we really wanted to do it i'm going to be doing more videos on the program over the coming uh weeks where i'm going to talk about it in more depth but at the moment i'm just going to just give you kind of an idea of what i was doing and that was just on the first day so I really enjoyed it. The second day was probably just as enjoyable as the first where I, you know, got together with these people again on the Thursday and we really just enjoyed it, you know. It was a fantastic, um, a, it was a fantastic experience. I've got another few more um, um, sessions with these people throughout the rest of the year and I just really enjoyed it. Uh, it will be a couple of weeks before in a couple of weeks time I'm due to meet my coach for the program and they will get in contact with me and it is just an amazing experience to do that and I'm looking forward to going out and sort of developing that more in the coming weeks and months. So that's just a wee bit about the program. I'm gonna talk more about it later on. Myself and one of my colleagues from We Student Nurses, Jack um, both him and I, um, on the, at the end of the first day, decided to do a wee video together talking about the programme. So that's going to be launched in the next sort of couple of days. And we are really excited to do that and we hope to collaborate more in the future. That's just a kind of wee update on the nursing side of things. At the mo and I'm, the next sort of thing is I'm on placement at the moment and I have to say I am absolutely loving my placement. It's one of the, probably going to be one of my favourite placements. I'm, on a ward placement at the moment, I, I can't say where I am just for confidential reasons and stuff. Um, it's not that I don't want to share it, but it's just that it's better it's just kept within the confidentiality, kept confidential. But I'm really enjoying it. I'm learning a lot. You know, I'm starting to feel more like a staff nurse now. I will put a disclaimer, I'm not a staff nurse yet. I'm only second year. But I'm starting to feel more like it now. I'm starting to get that okay moment kind of thing. I know what's going to be expected of me when I qualify, what I will be supposed to do, how I write out care plans, how I write out patient notes, you know, drug administration, you know, medicine administration, even, you know, dealing with these things. 
and dealing with all aspects of patient care, not just doing the medicine side of it, but that patient care, that personal care side of things, and getting mucked in, getting involved, help assisting with personal care, assisting patients who who need help with their food, you know, and all these other bits as well, as well as arranging packages of care and stuff, you know, getting all these sorts of things. So I'm really starting to enjoy that more, and I'll. I've got other few other things that I want to say at the moment, but I'm not going to say at the moment. Now I'll say that more in the next week or so, in the next few when I do more videos and vlogs in the next few weeks. So stay tuned for that. So that's all for me today. Just in terms of this wee vlog, it's not a proper vlog, but it's a more of an update of what kind of things I've been doing. But I hope that you've enjoyed today's vlog, and please stay tuned for more great content. If you enjoyed today's video, please like this video and subscribe to the channel and push the notification button by the by the subscribe button as it will update you when I publish a new video. So please stay tuned for more great content. So from myself at the journey of a student nurse, thank you and I hope to see you in the next video.